it's been a couple of days. Um, I haven't done much. I haven't edited and I haven't drawn much. These were the last morning sketches that I did. You can see the dates there is on the 25th and then the next one was on the 29th. I can't remember if I recorded this or not, but I guess you'll find out because it'll either be that recording first or this one, but we're going to start another day. It's just sometimes you get into a little bit of a slump and you just don't feel like drawing at all for a couple of days and and that's what happened. So um, I did try and do a few other types of drawings like in my colouring pencil book. These were the ones that, that I did on the that was I did it on the twenty fifth and on the yeah another one on the twenty fifth and then again on the twenty ninth. So I didn't draw in between those two days and I wrote some little notes down and keep drawing. I don't know what I'm doing at the best of times. <laughs> Which is true. I don't. I don't know what I'm doing at all. <laughs> Just going with the flow. And, and that was another one on the same day. It was, should I have quit when I was ahead? Because <laughs> I had some trouble with it. Just trying out, you know, different techniques um, and things like that. And then I did do quite a bit of drawing yesterday. I, I didn't record any of it. And then I thought, you know what? What if I didn't have a reference at all? Because, you know, sometimes you get a little bit sick of, of drawing from reference. And so I attempted to draw heads without any reference, just straight from imagination. And I I found it really um, difficult, I mean, obviously, for obvious reasons, but trying to not draw the same head over and over again, I had to force myself and it felt like I took a lot of steps backwards. But some of them turned out all right, some of them, some of them not so much. Um, but yeah, I did try to do different angles and tried to make them all look different because I was I was afraid that I was going to just draw the same head over and over. And I think I got a lot of different things in there. But anyway, that's what I've been up to. And now today we're back for another morning sketch. And I have some references of clothes. So it's a little bit different. And I'm going to use pencil, pen or I, I don't know. I'm just going to pick up whatever I've got, whatever... Whatever I feel like, because that's what Morning Sketches is about. Is about You can do whatever the hell you like. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, I was dry, parched. As usual, I'll put my references on the screen when, when, I, get, <laughs> when I start. I should just start. All right, let's go with the, the one that's got a, oh, what do you call that pattern? <laughs> I can't remember, like checkered pattern. Anyway, let's go with that. So we'll start. Now there's not going to be a, a countdown timer for each of these. I'm just going to use both of my timers like I did with my sketch and draw. And um, yeah, I should probably just start both of them. So one will be overall time and one will be per piece. So yeah, it's good. because it's been a little bit since, I don't know. Just it seems like I always forget what I'm doing. That's just really weird. And also when I've been doing when I was doing those um, heads without reference, I found myself getting really, really sketchy. Which is and and going for the chicken scratch, which is something that. Well, I guess in the longer sketches, that's fine. I mean, um, shorter sketches, that's fine. But for the longer ones, I'd rather not because I think I feel like it's a bad habit rather than understanding, trying to understand what it is that I'm drawing. So I'm just trying to imagine through... See, like here, I'm find, trying to find where the legs are, and I'd rather not chicken scratch so much. Oh, I've got to do another blind drawing video this week too. I forgot all about those. <laughs> So 
So I'm just trying to look at the shapes, overall shapes, I think, now that I've settled down a little bit. Well, sometimes you do need to take a little, you know, you get so excited to draw that you just need to take a moment to settle so that you can put everything together. Now this isn't going to be perfect because I'm not perfect. Oops. It's just been so rainy this week, and I and I I don't like to be, but I'm I am so affected by the weather. We've got three minutes so far. Her face is on a bit of an angle, so I need to. Well, her face. Well, I'm not gonna. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about it. <laughs> I'm. I'm still figuring, trying to figure out my shortcuts for facial features on a on a really tiny scale. I'm not sure I've captured much of it. You probably can't see, but I'm going to go over with pen now, which should make it stand out like dog's balls. Isn't it funny what we pick to, to draw first? <laughs> what area? <laughs> so I picked the most inconsequential part of this person's clothing. Just doing little marks. Might zoom in. It's really going back that way. I think I've screwed up the shape of this this thing. But that's fine. Six minutes, wow, wow. See how time gets away on you sometimes? All right.
I don't even know if that's the right amount of fingers. <laughs> I'm just trying to hurry up now because I've wasted a lot of time. Don't know why I did that. I don't even see that there. Oh wait, yes there is. All right, that's our first one. So we'll stop that one. So that was eight minutes. So I'll just put a one and eight. All right, well, I'm a little bit disappointed. I'm just going to zoom back out again. I can go, 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 go. All right. I'm a little, a little bit disappointed that I spent so much time on that. So we reset this one. Oops. We'll go for the next one. Eight minutes isn't too bad, I guess, but I wish I had gotten more in. All right, all right. Let's go with the next one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Just trying to see the shape. So that one will probably go there. So I can fit this one here. All right, yep, yep. Just making sure we can fit it all on the page. All right, timer. Zoom in. Okay, so I want her to stop about there. Oh, I don't even know what that mark is. So sometimes we just. That's all right. Morning sketch. Got to remember, morning sketch doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I might do some studies, more studies this week on, um, well, on lots of things. I feel like well, uh, because I've just been relying on just doing morning sketches and not other, other things that I've made myself a little bit rusty on those other things. For instance, I haven't done a long drawing for ages. She's got really long hair. I wonder if that's extensions. I cut my hair. <laughs> my hair was down to my waist, but I cut it because it just got so annoying. It'll grow back. And I, I cut it myself. <laughs> I'll admit that I probably shouldn't have. <laughs> because it's painfully obvious that I cut it myself. And I cut it really short, like not pixie short, but like the shortest page boy <laughs> well, with no fringe. <laughs> well, I don't get out of the house. No one's, I mean, I need to go to the shops um, to go shopping and I don't care. <laughs> it's, it's, it is a horrible, and also because my hair just went like that as soon as I cut it. <laughs> It just expanded. 
sideways. <laughs> but oh well. I'm not too worried. Usually, I've, I've, usually every couple of, you know, once in a while, a couple of years, I guess. Or well, not even that. I just, I just got so sick of it, that was all. Oh, this is a little bit... I made the body a little bit long. I'm not sure how that not sure how that's going, but I'll just leave it like that. So I need to move this up a little bit. Clothing seems to be um, like a, a total subject of its own to try and draw skill to learn. It's not, um, I mean, just because you can draw the human figure, it seems that clothing is, is just as difficult. It's all the folds, all the folds in the fabric. I mean, I've found that difficult in the past as well, drawing, or drawing fabric. It's so complicated. And it's complicated in a way that you don't expect. Just going to let that stop there because I want to put that other figure in as well. Six minutes. All right, let's see what we can do here. We'll just um, this hand might be a little bit dodgy, people. It's going to be a little bit dodgy. Ooh. Oh, how dodgy looking is that? That's not too... Uh, yeah. <laughs> I warned you. Okay, let's put a phone here so we don't have to draw her face at all. Big ass phone. What's that? iPhone plus. iPhone. Whatever iPhone they're up to these days. I'm still... I'm using a 7. <laughs> Not only because it was given to me by a family member who upgraded to um, whatever it was at the time. I've had it for a while. The only thing is it's not very big in storage and that's why I can't, I, I can't really use that. I don't feel comfortable using that to, to film instead of this webcam. So... That's why I do the way I do. I 
All right, knit it. Put the rest of the hair down in just an indication, and I think that will do. And that was eight minutes again, all right. Okay, that's not too bad. I mean, obviously the figure is off. But it's my morning sketch, and I'm just getting the feel for it. There's some pretty dodgy sketches going around. This next one is a little bit more dy dynamic in the way that she's posed. So I do want to try and get the hand and the handbag in. Just trying to figure out the best way to approach this. Yeah, all right, all right, I've got something in mind. So shoulders are going that way. Waist that way. Don't normally do hips like that, but. So that's going that way and the hips are going this way. Right, so her thigh is coming around here. I like to use my curved um, lines to help me see. This leg is going down there. So I would say that that starts from here. So I might actually not be able to get her feet in, but that's fine. She's sitting, she's sitting on here. It's got a high waist. And then she's really pushing out. Shoulders like, like this. Just gonna fix that up. That's a shame. That might get in the way. Or maybe not. Let's just reserve the space of the hand. Uh, yeah, that doesn't look right. So there, there, there. And this is right near her knee. I love the figuring out part of drawing, especially when I can actually do it. Because, <laughs> <laughs> be honest, that doesn't happen often. <laughs> oh my gosh. I should have just gone, oh, I, I wouldn't have been able to do my morning sketch in the, in the um, headspace I was. It wouldn't have made a good recording because I was going to say I should have just done my morning sketch to cheer me up, but <laughs> it doesn't work that way, unfortunately, for me. All right, let's just go in with the pen. Actually... I just want to put the direction of the face. I made a mistake there. All right. Why on earth I did two dots for a nose? 
I don't even know. What, uh, uh, stop it. <laughs> stop it. <laughs> stop drawing little details. Oh my gosh. I just get so focused sometimes that on stuff that doesn't matter. I'm going to move that over a little bit. Just trying a few different marks for the wrinkles. See what it is, the arm is behind this part here. All right, let's get, uh, let's um, zoom in. As best I can on this hand. Can't stay in one spot with this pen for too long because it will go through 20,000 pages in this whole sketchbook. Just going to group those two th thing, those the rest, the rest, the three fingers. <laughs> it's three, not two. starting to rain again. Gosh, this weather is just shocking. We're supposed to be the sunshine state. We're stuck, being stuck in this. Um, what's the opposite of the uh, uh, El Nino? El Nina? Nina? <laughs> I don't know. We're in the wet one. We've been in the wet one for years. We did have a dry spell for a couple of months and everything turned brown. Was, it was like, holy shit, where did all the water go? When all the grass and everything turned brown. But yeah. And I can't be that. It can't just be me that gets affected by the weather. Like you just get really sort of low energy. Low. You're in energy conservation mode. Alright, there's a... I want to get this one practice. Huh? Yeah. All right, how are we going? Oh, we're getting getting there in time. All right, so let's just. I don't. I don't know why I started. Well, we'll we'll see. This is the thing. This is why clothing is just so complicated for me. And that's why I didn't bother with the timer. Well, I say that and I've got two timers going. <laughs> but the, you, you know what I mean, the one where it times down. There's lots of... stuff going on there. All right, let's finish this arm, and I think then we're done. Okay, I'm pretty much done with this.
Um, and there's a shoe there. All right, but I just want to, the face is just so awful. You get my glasses. I feel bad leaving it like that, but I may end up making it worse because this pen is bleeding. I think I made it worse. Oh, the eyebrows. Where are her eyebrows? <laughs> yeah, this is something I need to work on oh, I think I think we'll call it at that so those stop oh that was three ten minutes and today is the 30th the first 24 considering um, that I haven't done done any of these for a couple of days that's not too bad not too bad at all so yeah I don't I don't think I recorded this see how the pen bleeds through I don't think I recorded this page I think this page was I just wanted to have a morning sketch to myself where I um, just concentrated on just certain parts of a figure and not the whole thing like you can see that I've tried to concentrate on the body and I've just let the legs go the same with this one it was just the the mass of the body and a little bit of the legs and I didn't even bother finishing that with this one I had a lot of trouble <laughs> I had a lot of trouble I thought it was an easy pose but it wasn't um, so yeah that was a little bit all over the place for that one it also took the longest because it was the hardest and then that was the the previous ones with the highlighters so yeah and that's today's actually I like the highlighters and I've got some right here that I can use oh. even though I've got my references in black and white I'm sure we can figure something out This is just a bit of a bonus time, not timed. Uh, orange. Just doing it because I feel like it. It's my morning sketch. I can do what I like, and so can you. So always remember that. Oops, I completely forgot this arm. That'll do. Yeah, I'll do this one in orange. Can't remember what colour it is in the original. I'm sure she doesn't have orange hair. We'll give her a blue phone. A little bit of blue shading, I guess. That'll do for that one. All right, let's do this one. Oops, that skin not. I don't know what colour this bag is, but it's pink. Put some blue in. Yeah, 
interesting. Interesting how it's mixing. All right. Add a little bit of colour to them because I just want to colour on my page. I like turning, I like going through my book and coming across pages like this that have got colour instead of ones like that. I'll just put this away. Instead of, you know, pay, copious pages of, of pencil. And it's nice just to come across something with colour in it every now and then. Yeah, so. So that's it. So that's today's morning sketch that I nearly didn't do. And we're at 30, we're probably, oh, we're way, way over time. So I may see what I can do about cutting this down a little bit. But anyway, I hope you all keep drawing and keep doing your morning sketches and just do whatever you want. It doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be good. It doesn't have to be anything. You can just do whatever you like. It can just be stuff from your head that looks like crap, like this. It doesn't, it really, really doesn't matter. It's your morning sketch. It's not your practice drawing time, unless you want it to be. It's just, you, you know, just letting go. But anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Keep drawing, everyone.